Nairobi residents are bracing themselves for potentially challenging times if the Nairobi County Finance Bill is approved. Under the leadership of Governor Johnson Sakaja, the county government is seeking to increase parking fees in the city from 200 shillings to 300 Kenyan shillings per day. This move is aimed at generating at least 19.9 billion shillings in the current financial year, with new fees slated for existing services. Hello, my name is Chief Okuzo from Plug TV. Among the services said to be impacted by these changes is the embalming of bodies at the city mortuary under the Environment and Public Health Unit. The proposed fee for adults will raise from 2,500 Kenyan shillings to 3,000 Kenyan shillings, while for children it will increase from 2,000 shillings to 2,500 Kenyan shillings. Additionally, the bill intends to impose fees on post-mortem services at the city mortuary, a service that has been provided free of charge in previous years. Now, the proposed fee for adults will be 5,000 Kenyan shillings, 3,000 Kenyan shillings for children, and 1,500 Kenyan shillings for infants. Cremation services at the Langata Cemetery will also be affected by the bill. Adult fees will rise from 16,800 Kenyan shillings to 20,000 Kenyan shillings. Children's charges will increase from 15,800 to 16,000 Kenyan shillings. And infant fees will be adjusted from 12,800 shillings to 14,000 Kenyan shillings. In response to the proposed finance bill, Mbakasi East MP Babu Awino, who is considered a potential candidate to replace Johnson Sakaja as Nairobi governor, criticized the governor's approach. Owino, who has been vocal about the poor state of Nairobi County, took to his social media platforms to express his concerns, saying, Sakaja, what have the deceased done to you? Show some mercy. We implore you, this nation disrespect us while alive, burdening us with taxes, and now they won't even let us rest in peace. In Swahili, this is what Babo Wino wrote. Sakaja, maiti wamekufanyia nini jameni? Samehea mahiti tafadhali, tunakuomba. Hi inchi tunadharauliwa tukiwa wazima, taxes juu, na hata tukikufa pia hawataki tuzikwe. And Nairobi residents have also voiced their disappointment with the proposed bill and have rallied behind Babo Wino, urging Sakaja to find swift solutions to address the concerns of the city's residents. What are your thoughts? Leave your thoughts on our comment section. That is it for now. Thanks for watching. Let's see you next time. Bye bye.